I'm about to reveal to y'all my project. And don't laugh. Been having some big major plans for this thing here. It's 2003 Jaguar S Type R. S Type R. Yes. It's a little rough, but I've cleaned it up. It's been sitting for about, I don't know, two years. Emblems are all knocked off. Back took a hard hit one time. I was on my way to work. Uh, yeah, I wiped out on a bridge. Took it hard on the passenger rear. But, the car runs, it drives. I'm pretty sure I just need a new transmission. Engine bay shabby. I just sucked out all the leaves. Show you. I sucked out all the leaves. Still pretty bad. I had to take some stuff off <clears throat> to get to a few parts to trying to troubleshoot this but it hasn't been going too well for me I'm pretty sure if I put a new transmission in this thing I'd be perfectly fine it would run drive I'd have a pretty sweet whip and uh, hope the keys are in there yeah let me give you a little interior tour. Give me that keys. It is not a bad ride. Sorry if y'all can't hear that. We got neighbors doing the uh, leaves and stuff because it is November. Almost mid November. We get the mirror down because there was a child in here monkeying around and he must have been swinging from this or something because it's down but yeah it's got the nice burl wood trim nice gauges it's all white leather it's embossed with the R logo, I don't know if y'all can see that. Let me see if I can see. Let me get this. Yeah, interior needs cleaned up a little bit. It's not bad. Seats are nice. They're nice. All this nice wood trim. It's dirty as all get out because it's been sitting here forever and, you know, sunroof works. All the lights work. All the power works in here. The seat, power seat. Got a, a J-Gate shifter here. Been reading some stuff on the uh, interwebs there about J-Gate shifters and how this is your problem when you got a transmission issue because that's what's going on in this car is it's a transmission issue i can't get it to, it goes straight in the third gear no what to do it doesn't sound terrible i mean it runs starts up and drives here let me give you a cold start right here with the awesome key whoop whoop, whoop. here we go open it's gonna keep making beeping noises that sound good I don't know this will work I don't know but it sounds pretty good 
thinking I'm thinking I'm about to get the cops called on me or <laughs> I think it sounds pretty dang good. We've got some here, let me shut the door. We got no fuel. Having some issues. Restricted performance. I know. Restricted performance. Gearbox fault. That's another. Oh, no fuel. Everybody's got that flashing on their dash right about now. COVID. It's not bad. Girlfriend is gonna get pissed. People in their stupid leaf blowers. <laughs> Neighbors gonna get so mad. I better quit. All right. Anyways, been watching a bunch of videos on uh, YouTube from watch jr go that dude is inspirational he's got a jag s type r he put the tranny in runs just fine now he's doing all kinds of smoky burnouts and stuff well that's kind of where i want to go with this vehicle i've had it forever i got it on a shady deal uh it was supposed to be a running driving functional Jaguar S Type R. With minor TLC. And that's not what I got. I got a crap box that I spent four grand on in hopes to get a nice vehicle because that's that's all the money I had. And I spent it on this. So <clears throat> if y'all have any comments or advice input anything i can get right at this moment for a vehicle that i blew everything that i had on because i thought it was cool I never bought a vehicle on ebay ever actually i've never really made a serious video so i'm speechless Watch some, watch some JR, watch JR Go videos, and then, I don't know, watch mine and then hit me up. That sounds like the best bet.